Queens has a great reputation both nationally and internationally. It was this reputation that brought Evo Drama up here, and now the second year libero feels right at home for the Queens men's volleyball team. My name is Evo Dramov. Uh, I'm in second year in commerce. I play volleyball and I'm a libero. I grew up in Bulgaria and Czech Republic at the same time, finished high school in both of these countries, even though I spent most of the time before Queens in Bulgaria. Um, I played volleyball while I was in high school, so these were my two basic priorities. Um, and then I was just looking for some opportunities um, abroad, mainly in England, in the States and Canada. And then I found this awesome program with a really good volleyball team, contacted Brenda, the Queen's Men's Volleyball coach, and it all just worked out. For a lot of people, adjusting to university is enough of a challenge. For Ivo, moving halfway across the world was an even greater adjustment. The differences he experienced made him not only grow off the court, but also on the court as he moved into the starting lineup. Last year was my first time in Canada, so it was even more kind of not awkward, it was just really different. The, everything is different from Bulgaria to Canada, and there was a lot of adjustments I had to make. But it's definitely worth it. Now I feel the change, like I feel one year of experience here. I feel that everything's easier for me, school-wise, volleyball, communicating with people, everything, my social life. Um, so it was just a big adjustment to make. Never been in a country like that. Uh, well, I like it, love it so far. The dump could save Dramon. I was a little bit, I was injured last summer, the summer before that, so two years ago. So I wasn't in very good shape when I came here at the beginning of the year, but continually like in, in the next few months, I got better and better. And then I guess I earned Brenda's trust and I started to get more playing time. Beginning to move into the leadership role, Dramov was able to plan a trip back to Bulgaria with the team. Not only a chance to improve the Gale's skill, but also a chance to bond with the team. When I came here, I heard that the team plans or travels three or, uh, once in three or four years to uh, Europe on a European trip to bond the team, to play some European teams and get ready for the second half of the season. So I was like, it was just an idea at the beginning. I was like, let's go to Bulgaria. And she was like, okay, but nothing more than that. But then when the time came for like us to plan it, she was like, are we gonna go to Bulgaria? I was like, do you want me to organize it? She said, yeah, absolutely. So I talked to my dad and all the people I needed to talk to in Bulgaria. And we just started to put it all together and organizing the entire thing. And it all just worked out perfectly. And she was happy with the plan. The Queen's Athletic Department was happy with the plan. So it just happened. Thompson is served. it off the tape and over, but it's going to be a news bomb. We did some sightseeing in Sofia. And we watched uh, our national, my national team, the senior men's national team against Turkey. And all the guys loved it. It was a great game, a lot of people, a lot of fans, great atmosphere. It was amazing. Like, the trip was awesome. Dramov played host, guiding the team to his hometown and even a little sibling rivalry match with his younger brother's team. On the second, we started with a game against my brother. And there's no rivalry, but I mean, like at home, you could feel the tension, like, are you ready for this game? What, I'm gonna beat you, I'm three years younger than you and all of that. Um, and we were losing, we were down two nothing, but then we came back and won three two, which was amazing. My brother was crushed, but I guess, there's nothing we can do about it. We wish Evo and the Gales a best of luck in the rest of the season as they try to climb the OUA standings this semester. Now over to the live feed where the men's volleyball team is warming up for today's game.